I'm Jenny Newell, and I'm the athletic trainer here at ASL. Just to give you some context, that means that I take care of the care and prevention of athletic injuries. I came in um, 2012, so I've been here a little while now, and um, the first thing that caught me off guard is the distance to get to places, specifically Cannons Park. Uh, I was used to having everything in one place right there and having a lot more kids being on fields at the same time doing big American football kind of stuff. Um, what I've noticed is, is that things here run at a very good, high, efficient level, specifically at ASL, and that we are kind of an interesting bubble um, within the greater UK uh, sports landscape. I've noticed a lot of help, like I'd say one player, he's always with her, he's always, he's always getting injured and she's always there to help him. She, she comes in her buggy, helps him when he's injured, give, wraps him up, helps him, you know, she does, t she does so much. Like, um, what, what I'd also say is she helps with concussion tests, she wants us to be safe. She, you can tell she really likes us and that's the best part. Um, that she really wants to help us. And she comes to Cannes Park every day to help us. Like, it's crazy how much commitment she has towards um, the team. So she is, uh, I think one of the main words I would use to describe her is collaborative. She is like one of the most supportive, um, like friendly, caring colleagues. Um, always like checking in, seeing how she can help. Um, and she's always like showing initiative as well. Like she's never someone that's like, oh, that's not my job, right? She's always like seeing how she can support um, like the PE team, the fitness department, um, any sports team. She's always like, yeah, so I'd say collaborative, um, friendly, caring, really thoughtful as well. It sounds cheesy, but it really is the students. Uh, being able to work with teenagers and watching people grow through their phases and get through stuff and find out that they are tougher than they thought or make different choices in life than maybe they thought when they were younger um, is really enjoyable. Uh, I think we definitely need a lot of help with injuries because we play so much football so it is like really vital that we're all sharp and fit to play and by giving us information, by helping us when we're injured, wrapping us up, it really helps um, keep the team strong. Jenny, um, she probably has a lot of other commitments but she always comes and cares for us, she always visits us and helps us, um, which I really appreciate. I feel like the students love her and care about her as much as she loves and cares about them. Like she's so thoughtful and caring towards the students and I feel that reciprocated. Like so many students, um, I mean sometimes people come down when they're not even injured. They just want to like talk to her or tell her about like how, uh, how the recovery is going or something like that. So I feel like it's a really strong relationship that she has with her students. I don't ever feel like I have enough time for each kid and that's mostly because I come in each day, my day starts at 11.30 here, I can see people during lunch or if they have an afternoon free time and then after school I have to make a decision of where I need to be and that's based on mostly risk and the number of people doing an activity. So I don't feel like I get to see cross country and crew very often. I don't see tennis and track as often as I see the things that are at Cannons Park. And that's a really big regret for me because I genuinely love those sports. Every student athlete that I get to, to meet is genuine and excited and I'd love to see them compete more. Mm -hmm.